one to be? Big. I heard you wanted to be what? Massive. Cut. Lean. What's good, everybody? It's your boy, Sweet. Hey, look, tutorial video. I get a lot of females always asking me about this. They want to work on their outer thighs, which, when I say this, and my legs are pale, by the way, so uh, sorry, I wear shorts. I can't go outside and tan in a bikini like ladies and get like a nice tan leg. I'm sorry. So my legs are, I'll buy now. All right. <laughs> so the, when I say the outer part, I'm talking about like, you see how, which I'm not cut up and I'm not chiseled, but you see the sweep in my leg? This is the outer, the lateral head of my quad, okay? Inner, right in here. There's two ways that you can do, put the shoulder leg press. You're gonna get you a leg press, all right? It's all about leg placement, all right? It's all about leg placement. All right, so what you're gonna do, you on a leg press, start out with, obviously I know I can probably do like 10 plates on each end on a leg press. I'm not gonna do that, you know what I mean? But this exercise. So to first start out, it's opposite. So if I wanna work on the lateral heads of my quads, the outer parts, my outer sweeps, I'm gonna put my feet together. I like to put my feet completely together, but you can have them, you know, about right here. You know what I mean? Have them neutral grip, well not neutral grip, neutral stance, but I like to have mine really close. And the thing is, what you're gonna do, you're gonna come off. Now, you can go about this one or two ways. You can either go all the way down and make your knees touch your chest, but I can't do that because y'all know my hips are fucked up, okay? So you'll see that when I go down, you see how like my legs flare out? You can do that, you know what I mean? It's working the same exact thing. But right here, what you're gonna do, you're just gonna go down. I like to come down real slow and push it up fast. So go down real slow and push it up fast. So you'll actually see, if you come from the side, Chris, you're gonna side view. You'll see when I'm going down slow, you'll see this is actually activated. So right here, going down slow, 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 power up. Going down slow, power up. So you'll see, like I said, working on the lateral head, just going down slow, is gonna target the outer head and it explode up. So normally what I do with that, I'll do like three sets of 10. You see that? I said three sets of 10. <laughs> I am tired, boy. You're gonna do three sets of 10, all right? So you're gonna go down real slow and just explode up with that. And you'll find out what kind of weight you can use at first. Normally I could go up to four points, but just for a demonstration, I did too. Now to work on your inner thighs, I know a lot of girls want to target that. Only thing you're going to do, and these are my favorite because it's, the, it's comfortable to me because of the way I squat. But you're going to, you know how, all right, so this is a close grip. Right here, this is a close. This is about pretty normal for everybody. Now this is wide. When you go wide, this is what's going to target the inner thighs, okay? So we're going to be right here. We're going to break it. Only thing you gotta do, same concept. I like doing it. Going down real slow, real slow, explode up. Going down real slow, stand in control, explode up. And this is gonna target inner thighs. Slow, explode up. wide so just remember if you want to work on the outer part of your legs keep them really close if you're looking to work the inner put them out real wide that's something that you can add to your routine because if you're trying to get a uh, you want to get some uh you want to get some little chicken legs you want to get some little chicken legs you can you can just add that to your routine but other than that don't forget as always tell your moms Tell your aunts, tell your baby sisters, long as she over what? 18, 
Hey, you tell them about us. <laughs>